Marsha Blackburn was sworn in yesterday as Tennessee's first ever female U.S. Senator, and she is already receiving praise from veteran senators and politicians. Our Washington correspondent Drew Petrolomo was there as she took the oath administered by a high-profile special guest. As Marsha Blackburn took her historic oath of office, the man administering the oath was the newest justice on the U.S. Supreme Court. Thank you to the justice um, for being here. We're so proud of him. Justice Brett Kavanaugh's recent Senate confirmation hearing degenerated into a vicious partisan battle. Kavanaugh fought back against accusations of sexual misconduct and won confirmation. Blackburn was one of Kavanaugh's fiercest defenders and remains one of his biggest fans. He is someone who has been uh, supportive of me and he is someone who is supportive of the Constitution and I was thrilled that he would take the time and come across the street and swear me in. Kavanaugh wasn't the only high profile guest. Former Senator Bob Corker, who Blackburn is replacing, was also there. The two had a rocky relationship during Blackburn's campaign but Corker said now he's cheering her on. I'm convinced after watching the deliberate way you've come into office, you're going to be an outstanding senator. Tennessee's senior senator Lamar Alexander was also on hand as the torch was formally passed to the first female senator to represent the volunteer state. In Washington, I'm Drew Petromo. And Senator Blackburn says that she is excited and ready to get to work for the people of Tennessee.